For more than 100 years, the Cockle Creek smelter stacks dominated Bullaroo's skyline, while their discharge impacted on local health and left a legacy of contamination. Following its closure in 2003, remediation of the former Pazminko lead and zinc smelter began in earnest in 2006 with the demolition of its iconic 87 metre high chimney stack. Since then, a lead abatement scheme has been developed and implemented for residential properties based largely on a cap and cover system using clean soil to cover contaminated material. It was designed to address the health concerns of local residents and deal with the ongoing issue of contaminated soil. But the question remains, is what has been done good enough? In July 2015, I travelled to the site of the former Bunker Hill smelter in Idaho and learned how they dealt with what was one of the largest public health issues from industrial contamination ever in America. <laughs> This brief documentary follows that journey and suggests some elements of their strategy that I believe could be useful in managing the legacy issues found in Bullaroo and adjacent suburbs in perpetuity.